Hello everyone, this is Care. In our previous tutorials, we've learned many interesting opening facts. And today I will show you how to quickly create this opening fact using circles. The method used is very simple. Just a follow step and you will be able to do it. If you are interested as well, keep watching the video. First, let's open Vapor Blogger. If you haven't downloaded yet, use the link in the description box down below to free download the software. Click here to create a new text ledger and delete the text part. Click here to change the background color of the video. We choose white. Then click here to save a screenshot. Next, import this white image into Vapor Blogger. Now change the background back to black. Place the white image on the main track. And then find a circular mask in the effects. Drag it onto the effect track. Then, in Inspector, find the proper parameters. Change the first parameter to 0.8 and the second one to 0.01. Now we have a white circle. Click here to save a screenshot. Now import a circle screenshot into Vapor Vlogger. Delete all the materials on the timeline. Next, place a second screenshot on the main track. Now, let's start adding animation effects to it. Click Motion. Create a keyframe at the start. Then adjust display area. Next. At 1.4 seconds, we create a keyframe. Click here and change the parameter to 4000. Change the speed to smooth the speed down one. And then return to first keyframe. And change the parameter to 4000. And then move the display error down to the edge of the screen. Next, we add a keyframe at a 2 second mark. Let's play it and check. Well, the following animation is now complete. Now, at 2.6 seconds, add another keyframe. Change the width to 400. And then adjust the display area so that the right side of the image looks completely white. Change the speed to smooth the speed up 1. And finally, add a keyframe at the end position. Click Apply. Now the animation for the first circle is done. Next, we reduce the opacity in the inspector to 40. And then duplicate this laser and place it on the overlay track. Click Motion. Select the second keyframe. Increase the parameter a little bit. Here I set it to 5000. Next, we adjust parameters for the first and third keyframes. And adjust the display area. No need to adjust the other keyframe. Click Apply. Then in Inspector, change the opacity to 70. In Fine Blend Mode, and choose Lighten. Next, create a new overlay track. Duplicate this material again, and place the copied material below. Click Motion. And just like before, we adjust the parameters of these three keyframes. Here, I set it to 6500. Once finished, change the opacity to 200 in the inspector. Let's play and see. Well, now the circles appear together. If you want them to fall separately, like in the sample, you can move the materials a little bit backward. Once finished, it, click here to export it as a template. Next, we create a new project. Import the materials you need for the effect, along with the template you just made into Vapor Vlogger. 
Place the video on the main track and the material on the overlay track. Trim off about one second. Then in inspector, select the height. Next, scroll down to blend mode and choose multiply. Let's play it and check the effect. Well, it looks good. It's not very simple. Try it out for yourself. All right, that's it for today's video. If you want to know more about the other tricks or what has been going on with Vertical Vlogger, be sure to click that subscribe button to your subscribe channel if you haven't yet. And we'll see you soon in the next video. Hope you enjoy. Bye bye.